Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best dash cams. Starting at number 5. Vantru E1. Neat and relatively compact, the Vantru E1 is an attractive dash cam that's capable of recording 2.5K video at 30 frames per second. It can also record full HD footage at a smoother 60 frames per second for enhanced detail while you drive. Results in our review prove sharp night and day, with accurate colors and acceptable noise in low light. Our testing also revealed that the optional polarizing filter usefully reduces dashboard reflections, while the 160-degree angle captures a wide view of what's ahead. We found that the E1's magnetic mount works well, but the lack of sideways adjustment does limit its use if you can't fit it centrally. A tiny 1.54-inch screen offers a preview when installing, but the smartphone app is the more useful way to tweak settings. You don't get the driver assistance systems of other dash cams, so it's up to you or your vehicle to spot speed cameras and potential collisions. That said, you still get Wi-Fi and GPS connectivity, and we like that Vantru has focused on video quality over unnecessary extras. Coming at number 4. Nexar Pro. Aimed at those who spend extended periods behind the wheel, the Nexar Pro is a dual cam solution that can record video both inside and outside a vehicle. Comprised of two separate camera units connected by a cable, we found the setup to be pretty neat, even if it took up a fair bit of screen real estate. It doesn't record in 4K, but from our tests we found its 1080p video perfectly serviceable. The external camera fared well even in tricky shooting situations, from heavy rain to bright sunshine. We found that the Nexar app is central to the twin camera experience, it's where you can fine-tune settings, generate incident reports and back recorded clips up to the cloud, Nexar bundles cloud storage in for free. Other useful tools include break-in alerts if someone tries to tamper with your car, as well as GPS data logging. There are cheaper dash cams out there with fewer features to play with, but if the security of your car is crucial to your daily life, the Pro is hard to beat in terms of protection and overall value. At number 3. Nextbase 622 gigawatts. With impressive video and flagship features, we think the Nextbase 622 gigawatts has a lot to offer. We found its 4K slash 30P footage almost cinematic in testing, with crisp definition and outstanding detail. Low-light algorithms also improve results in tricky conditions. Drop down to 1080p and we found that you can shoot 120 frames per second slow mo that makes it easier to pinpoint things like registration numbers. We were impressed with how effectively the built-in polarizing filter reduced windscreen glare, too, and how well the digital image stabilization soaked up road vibrations. Our tests did reveal that setup was slightly fiddly, and the 3-inch touchscreen requires obvious swipe inputs. We also had some trouble connecting to our smartphones to transfer video clips. That said, we still think the 622 gigawatts is a simple camera to use overall. We found its interface intuitive, while the display is big, sharp and clear. Footage is automatically saved when an incident is detected, and thanks to clever what three words integration, the 622 gigawatts can pinpoint the location of stricken vehicles and send it on to emergency vehicles. The next base IQ, above, is even smarter still, but if you want a capable dash cam that reliably captures clear 4K video, the 622 gigawatts is well worth considering. Number 2 of my list. Garmin Dash Cam. The Garmin Mini 2 is tiny enough to disappear behind your car's rearview mirror. Despite its size, it records in full HD at 30 frames per second with HDR. In our review, it produced footage sharp enough to pick out key details like registration plates, regardless of the ambient light and weather conditions. We found installation quick and simple in our tests, too. The plastic arm takes up very little windscreen space, while the ball and socket joint makes it easy to reposition. The interface is similarly accessible, Though there's no display, shortcut buttons let you save clips and mute the mic with one touch. We found that the Garmin Drive smartphone app, for iOS and Android, lets you easily change settings, review recordings, and check the camera's view. 
While features are limited to voice controls and a G-sensor that can detect collisions, we felt that GPS was the only real omission. Unless you need the best dash cam with driver assistance functions, the Garmin Dash Cam Mini 2 will leave you wanting for very little. Simple, subtle and reliable, it's the definition of set and forget technology. And number 1. Next Base IQ. A smart surveillance camera for your car, the Next Base IQ is as feature packed as dash cams come. Available in 1K, 2K, and 4K variants, it's a premium solution with a suite of connected skills. That includes parking assistance, a voice activated witness mode, and the ability to check in on your vehicle via the Next Base IQ app, as well as GPS, Bluetooth, and Wi Fi connectivity. All three versions include an interior camera, and there's an optional rear-facing unit. You will need a paid subscription to get the full benefit of its abilities, which means the IQ can quickly become a costly bit of kit. But our tests found that it's also an impressive one. Setup proved simple in our review, while the app made it easy to access its many features. Footage and audio from our 4K review unit was predictably excellent, too. Because powered is delivered directly from the car's battery, the system remains active even when the engine's off. It will be overkill for many road users, but if you want a complete, all-in-one camera to monitor your car at all times, the next Space IQ is as clever as they come. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.